class of good manufactured before i am going to explain this concept i want you must know few things here are two type of companies one is non manufacturing companies second is a manufacturing companies the cars of goods manufactured only manufacturing companies are calculating calculating but the non manufacturing companies are not calculating the other point is it is not shown on balance sheet not shown on income statement but managers also need it for decision making the basic difference between manufacturing and non manufacturing companies are the inventory manufacturing company are three type of inventory one is raw material second is work in progress inventory third is finished good inventory the non manufacturing only opening inventory and purchases and ending inventory only ending inventory is shown on balance sheet let me explain uh, the cost of good manufacture with the help of a schedule it is very easy to explain it i am i separate this page it will be very easy to explain if any additional point i will discuss here first opening raw material here would add purchases purchases are the net purchases let's say i it is 100 purchases are 50 and if we add these two amount 150 this total we will say cost of material variable for use then we will subtract ending raw material inventory let i say the ending la raw material is 30 then we will get our total 120 this amount we will say raw material used then we will add track material track labor here i said track labor is 80 the total is come is 200 is total we say uh, prime 
cost. So prime cost is equal to tract material plus tract labor. Then we will add factory overhead factory overhead basically indirect material indirect labor utilities factory depreciation any other expenses which we, which is are not part of direct labor and inventory we will charge to factory overhead let i say the factory overhead is 100 the total of the prime cost and factory overhead is 300 is a called a total manufacturing cost so total manufacturing cost we will say TMC is equal to direct material plus direct labor plus overhead cost it become a total manufacturing cost then we will add opening work in process inventory let i say it is a Sixty dollar and we will less ending work in process inventory. I say this is a fifty dollar T. This got a cost of good manufactured so cost of goods cost of goods manufactured is equal to opening work in process inventory plus TMC total manufacturing cost less ending work in process inventory it will become a cost of good manufactured if we will add beginning finish good Now entry, so it is a hundred and less 
ending. Finish codes. We will get a cost of goods sold amount. In this case, it is equal to. Or forty CTS in this case is equal to opening finish goods plus cost of goods manufactured less. Ending training goods. Here, in other point is when we will add deck labor with happy or app. We will say it's conversion cost. Direct labor plus overhead is equal to conversion cost. In this way, the manufacturing company are calculated the cost of goods manufactured. The cost of goods manufactured is equal to raw material used plus direct labor plus factory overhead and opening working process less ending working process. Cost of goods sold manufactured we will calculate. In this way, this amount is a cost of goods sold, cost of goods manufactured.